Hey guys, Adam Hart here. Here's how to get the Doom shotgun, also called the Kadoom. All the other blueprints in the Doom Easter egg room and bring out the shotgun into the open world so you can keep it. So first you need to find five ducks. One duck is an old villador, Houndfield, right here on the map. We're gonna jump off this roof and it's right here in the swamp area. So every time you take these, they make a growl sound. That's how you know you definitely got it. Another duck is in Central Loop, Lower Dam, right here on the map. We're going to get on this bridge because it's over by the water. And by the way, you can spam the crouch button and then jump to do a double jump anywhere in the map. And then you can paraglide. It's on the edge, and as you can see, it's on a little podium. <laughs> Central Loop, the wharf. This one's underwater. Go on top of these structures, jump over the side, and we're going to go underwater and lockpick the car, which is where this duck is. Central Loop to the left of Garrison. You're actually going to come here during the story, and if you do during the story, it's going to look a little different. So we're going to go through this door right here, get on the car, turn around, and we're going to go up the wall. And it's going to be on this left tower. Right here on this table. Another duck is in Central Loop Garrison, and in this case, this is our last duck. This duck is in VNC Tower. So go up this rapple to go up this building. Go through these doors on the left, and then go left again. And then turn right, and the elevator is going to be right there. And on the elevator, it'll say VNC Tower Roof, so hit that. And then wait in real time, because this game is a troll. Once it opens, turn left, and this is a little tricky, but you guys can do it. Jump over, grab onto that, and then you're going to fall in those windows right there. And the safe is right here. And the code is 666. Nearby, there's a hint. It's a Slipknot reference. It says, if I'm 555, then you're... I thought that was pretty cool. Now that you guys have all the ducks, go to the elevator on the first floor of the VNC tower. We're going to take a left, and then we're going to take a right, and the elevator is right there. Select basement. When the elevator opens, turn right and go straight through the water and the door on the right. You're going to find an elevator. Before you take it, make sure you empty all your accessories in your inventory, because we don't want any issues when we keep the Doom shotgun. Once you get to this elevator, select level 0. You arrive at this room. Place a duck on every table. From the entrance, turn left, grab the cable, and simply go across the room to connect every cable, which then spawns the Doom shotgun that allows you to start a challenge. Now to keep the shotgun after this challenge is complete, all you have to do is just quit the game. That's all you gotta do, guys. You'll quit, go to the menu, hit continue, and then the shotgun will be in your inventory, and you can equip it to your accessories. I actually forgot to empty my accessories in my inventory when I was in the Doom challenge. If this happens to you, hold down or die to end the challenge. When you're back in the cable room, you can empty your accessories, then start again. Now before we get the gun, let's get the blueprints, which are Dying Force and Mistress Sword, as well as a note from the devs. Alright, so let's do this. Just follow where I go. Now, for all of these, we're going to go right every single time. Watch out for the exploding zombie. We're pressing L2, by the way, to shoot. Right around here, a zombie's going to come up right behind us, turn around, take them out. We're going to keep going right here. And we're going to come to this green area. We're going to get rid of this exploding zombie. We're going to get rid of this guy, and we're going to turn right. Okay, we just killed him. We're going to open up the door. And this is Dying Force. So there's a My Precious Blueprint, there's also the Dying Force, and we die picking up the Dying Force, so I say we've earned it. Now here we go again, we're gonna keep going right, like I said, get rid of the exploding zombie, just follow where I go. We can just skip him, we're gonna turn around right here, they usually come up right behind you at that point. We're gonna get to the green room again, just skip this guy, go left. And there it is, the Mistress Sword. And then, just go up the ladder, and we're going to find the Dev Note. And we're going to have all the blueprints. And then you can just quit the game. Now, this is the point when I realized my accessories were not empty. So that's when I held down to end the challenge. I went back to that little room with the cables, and I emptied my accessories. I restarted the challenge, and once the timer started, I then quit to the main menu. You just want to make sure you quit when that timer is going. And then just hit continue. Now once you get back into the game, go to inventory, accessories, and it'll be there. Equip it, go outside the safe zone, and have fun. 
It is absolutely incredible. One of my favorite Easter eggs ever. I'm going to show how to do the other Easter eggs in this game. If you'd like quick tutorials on that, consider subscribing. If you guys would also like a crossbow, I'm giving them out on stream still. I stream on this channel, and you can find my streams on my homepage. And if you'd like a notification for that, you can subscribe to the channel. If you guys enjoyed this, please drop a like, and comment below what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Boom. Boom, boom.